and take the uh, coils out, they just kind of pull up gently, you just got to wiggle them, give them a little bit of oomph and a little bit of help and here they come. We can pull off the uh, other two, there we go, one, just, I did the first one without gloves, a plastic bit into my fingers, so I put a pair of gloves on for these, made life a lot easier, get a lot more purchase on it. Yeah, going to remove the uh, cam cover. I'm following the Haynes manual here. So. Has left the cam cover. I pried this corner open just a hair. Didn't take any real pressure. It says left it from the right hand side. Uh oh. There was a little spacer of some kind. I guess. I'll figure out where that came from. A little something just dropped as I did that. I'm gonna peel a gasket off here. I have no idea what that piece of metal was. It's a tiny little thing. Almost looked like a watch battery. I guess this is. Oh, there's another one. Alright, I've got to figure out what on earth those things are. Okay, I'm going to lay this down. i got a tiny little round. It says 245 on it. I guess. Oh, it's a valve shim. It's a valve shim. Alright, I guess that's what it is. I guess it's a valve shim. I didn't expect to see valve shims floating around top, but I guess we're. Uh, we're under catastrophic conditions here, so uh, that's uh, I'm expecting to find at least bad cams. Alright, got one. One! Yeah, where's two? Two is two. Two, I guess it will go. Three is next to one. See how much tension I'm having to put on this. I'm spinning the engine around. Three, four, five is the far corner. Five, six. Six, uh, they're all coming now. Okay, seven. Yeah, let's do it on top of the cam chain. Seven. Eight. Nine. Nine. Ten. Crap. Twelve. Thirteen. Thirteen. Fourteen. I guess I could have done with size for a wrench. Fourteen. Fifteen. And finally. 16. Okay. Around the uh, each spark plug hole is a, an O ring. There are three dowels for locating the head, and each of those has an O ring around them as well. Okay, I lifted the, uh, the cam up, and now I'm just basically you just hold that one a second so it doesn't rock around and bang around. And I might just get the chain off. There we go. That's the first one. Okay, you can lift the exhaust off. Okay, that can drop down there because it's actually a rod. I'm just 
I'll put these on one side, I imagine. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, this one's got some chipping on one of the intake lobes. The other lobes aren't bad. I don't know if that's salvageable. Uh, See, all pull this. the cam oh, chain guide out. Uh, there's a bolt here that goes through the cam chain well that's holding the cam chain in. So I'm just going to pull him out. And we'll be able to lift the cam chain out. Tuck him back in in place just for now.